Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and today's video, we are gonna be going back to some old games I played when I was a little girl, and most of the games are from 2007, 2009, and um, a lot of the games gave me nostalgia, and these games used to be my favorite games I played back in the time, and a lot has changed from these games to like the now games I played, nowadays like DB, Monster Island, Let's go to these games! And I'm gonna film nostalgia check after this video. Our first game! This is called Hide and Seek and it's made by Lando64000, these guy who helped out in Pokemon Brick Bronze. This game used to be my favorite when I was very young. And um, pay for hide and seek stuff. Don't know how many maps there are. Um, this one used to be my favorite map on it. Yeah. I'm surprised this game is, is like alive. This was made in around 2000 something, but I remember playing it in 2010-ish. This is the next game. It is so far in the heights. The original. This is such a classic. Like, I cannot believe this is still running and I'm pretty surprised. But I played it a lot. And there's also a sequel that's like Soul Fine Heights 2, but I don't know what happened to it. And then there's Soul Fine Heights 3, Soul Fine Heights 4, which will go after this one. But this is my favorite one because I really loved uh, Soul Fighting, but I suck. And I mean, I really suck, look. Unless. Oh yeah, I do. I mean, practice makes perfect. I go to all the duels, like. Just for the fun of it, and um, some people like stay here for like hours and get like three hundred and something kills. I'm like, how does that work? My highest was three hundred twenty. That was me like wasting my life. <laughs> I was like, I was like very young. And then it's like puppy guarding. So oh, yeah, I remember puppy guarding. That was like really annoying. Yep, this guy's puppy guarding. Let me see if I get that. I, I can't. Um, it's a girl. Okay, well, whatever. Um, but let's go to Sofan High School. Do know why there's music in here, but welcome to. Oh, hello. Oh my God, hello. This was my coming back game, Sofan High School, and I don't know what. When was this last updated? Um. Oh, it was May. Oh crap, I got here. But this is very, like, a really classic, and um, I'm gonna turn on my volume so you guys can hear me. I didn't know they have this. Oh, hey, I really didn't need that. But I really like this game because like it has a lot of action in it, and yeah, I know some is like in my perspective like boring, but I mean it's good like challenge, right? This is the next game, and this is such a classic too. This is King the Hill, and it's straightforward. Kill the king, you become king. Kill all the peasants. Ooh, fan art. Do you know why this is here, actually? Like, I don't know why this is here. Maybe it's just the decor or something. But this seems to be my favorite game of all time. And yes, this game does get a lot of exploits. And this is the throne here. Uh, don't know why this is broken. And um, I always have problems like trying to get king. And I remember when you get king, you can drop a boulder. And guess that's a secret down here. But this game, like um, back in 2010, for those of you who um, started around 2012 or 2013, you know, like recently. Um, these kind of games, like, there weren't many guys, and shops were basically like, I'll just go up here and show you. There's like, this stuff right here. And then you just, yeah. Invincibility. But a lot of these games back in 2012, and like, my time, they were very simplistic. The king over here, let me try to kill him. Oh god, okay. Um, so, slay the king, you become king. I have a boulder. Let me see the boulder to wash it. Let me try it, like, random person. What? It doesn't work anymore, that's sad. Okay, well, I'm to kill. Ah, uh, you all can't defeat me. Oh my god, this guy has a double blade sword, I'm gonna die. 
Okay, well, this is kind of a straightforward game. Welcome to Bridge Sulfight! Yes, I am aware. I have played a crap ton of Soul Fighting game when I was really little. I don't understand why. Probably Soul Fighter was my thing and doesn't exploit it. Perfect. I really didn't need to see that. But, um, this game was straightforward Soul Fight and. Okay, cool. Um, I just saw a shout ouch. I, I died. What? Perfect! Exploiters! Lots of the soft fighting games I played, they have exploiters, and I said this so many times in some of my videos, but back in my time, there were many exploiters, and I didn't like them, and I was like, oh my gosh, I want to report. But that was not as little. Nowadays, I don't really care as long as they don't screw something up. Welcome to the Mummy! This game was so popular back in. 2007-2008-ish, and this was one of the most popular games that I've uh, ever played, I think so. This is just a sequel, um, there's an original called The Mummy, but it's dead, so. There's The Mummy here, he is, he's a straight face. But, basically the objective, you grab the duck, you have to look at the duck, ah, I escaped, um, and the mommy comes to life. Um, and everyone dies. <laughs> Just kidding, but... The mommy is coming to life. You basically have, uh, 10 minutes to survive the mommy and his ducks. And in 10 minutes, you would just survive. Straight forward. Again, this game's like these are very simple back in my time. And now these things, which you have to press all buttons. Um, and then you can't really shoot, like you can't really kill the mummy. And you have to get 10 minutes. And I really didn't like the 10 minutes idea because it's a waste 10 minutes of my life. Um, but whatever. And you have cheeps over here. Um, and look, and I don't know, I don't understand what happens to touch. Well. If there's like animation, uh oh. But basically, it gets screwed and you explode. Straightforward stuff. Okay, we didn't need really to see any of that. Let's go to the next game. If you guys don't know this game, I am upset. Just kidding, but for those of you who don't know this game, this is one of the most earliest games I've ever played. It is called Thrillville, and how it Thrillville is to. JJ Perfect X Five series called Roblox Go Crazy, and this is basically a comedy theme park has death stuff. If you watched my um like st the creation of Star Wars Three's Way to Die video, then this is where I filmed that because um back in the time there was set but in the work, but they got rigged, so then I had to actually like say suicide to die like this person has suicide or just. Like, jump these things are deadly, but straightforward stuff, theme park, and actually, fun fact over there, over there, there used to be a hotel, but that got taken out. And I don't know why, I, I just realized this guy's here. Welcome to Mike Mini Games! Unfortunately, I couldn't find the original because Mike's account got terminated, I believe, so this is the best I could find, and. Um, it's like the earliest mini games I've ever played back in 2007 and 2008. There were lots of mini games like soccer, uh, hit each other off. Uh, basically, one of your arms is replaced with a long rod and you knock each other off. Um, tower race, uh, kill the giant, disappearing platforms. Um, I think there's like another one which I forgot what it's called. Uh, oh yeah, um, zombie thing like don't become a zombie. I don't know the technical name, but um, zombie blocking. Uh, I think that's all. Like, I don't really have anything else, else to say, but uh, I don't know what this guy's doing. Um, if you guys remember the turning to zombie. 
you have a history. Like I, 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 I guarantee it. Well, sort of. But I'm really s sad to see this game go by. But visiting this gave me such nostalgia, and whoa, I don't know how that happened. Um, that yeah. Um, next game. All right, this is the final game we will be visiting for this video. Welcome to the Hunger Games by Aussie Pig, and this was. Oh my god, one of the most popular games ever, and it's based off the Hunger Games series. Um, I remember like, oh my god, there's like so many, uh, high levels. But my highest level was, um, 13 I guess, and my rank, I don't remember my rank anymore. But these are the maps here, um... And I've read all the books of the Hunger Games, but I haven't seen the movies. And uh, I will. This poison also was my favorite because it does a lot of damage. I'm more to the defensive side, and I don't play this anymore because one of the side I got bored of it. Second is that uh, Ozzy Pig like reset my level, and I made it so for it to reach level 13, and I and yeah. Um, I used to do videos so much on this game, and I had to delete them because they were cancer, and there were so many like, um, I really don't want to say ghettos or anything, but I'm just, it's just me, like my opinion of it. But, um, that's all for this video we're gonna do today. That, I think that was like the worst ending I've done on this channel. <laughs> Uh, but anywho, this game is really giving no soldier. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, let me know if you played one of these games in your time, and if you still play them or not. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye!